Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Medieval Dynasty. So today, today I want to go mining today, uh, see if we can't walk uh, up to that place. Actually, you know what, we probably could afford going up there by cart as well. That might make it easier for transporting. Um, so there's there's that, and there was something else that we were working on. I haven't actually... Um, been working on recording for a couple days. So I took a Monday off uh, just to kind of get a break. It was on my birthday, so I thought, you know, that would be a good day to take off. But um, I forget what we were working on. I think we were working on the um, daub, if I remember correctly, for that other building and the building up there. But. Um, that's probably not going to go anywhere. Uh, we got some shoes that we can sell. Maybe we can get some money from that as well. And let's see here. Probably sell those feathers. And probably the 10 buckets as well. Okay, before we go though, um, we should probably go ahead and fill up that bucket and just make sure that they have all the resources that they need. Now, I can't remember if we bought out everyone up here. I think we might have. I'm not sure about the cattle guy, but um, we'll, we'll take a quick look. And if we did, then we'll move to the next town. And we're going to need some pickaxes as well, so. I just need to find the guy that deals with cattle first. I think that we might have already bought out Hook. Where is he? He was here just a second ago. Oh, he's up here now. All right. How are you? Best goods in the valley. Okay, he hardly has anything, so apparently we'll have to go over to um. Have a good day. The other village. Let's see if we can't find everyone. How Might are be you? able to sell some of these feathers. My words never disappoint. Ten feathers. All right, so See you soon. they absolutely have no money now. All right, and then the farmer, we could probably sell some feathers to him. Hey, old friend. Only the best products here. Okay, he doesn't even have enough money Goodbye. for feathers. <laughs> uh, we'll check the tavern next, and then we'll head on over to the other town. Hey, old friend. Only the best products here. Uh, not Goodbye.
Alright, so I'm currently mining. I don't know how much resources that we have already. Um, 6 tin ore, and then we have 15 copper ore. So we need more, definitely more tin ore. Uh, we have a whole bunch of stone. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to dump the stone out here. Uh, mainly... For now, <clears throat> we'll carry it back, back to the... Um, the place uh, or town when we leave, but I need the space for tin. I'm gonna need quite a bit of it. And that gives us 10. We're gonna need a little bit more, I think. So this is basically tin, and then the Orange stuff is copper, and then there's white stuff as well, which is salt, I believe. So, this is tin. And there's also iron uh, deeper in the mines. I don't know if it's unlocked now, uh, because we have 14. Um, because uh, you can actually get the, the caves deeper if you build a mine, but we don't have that unlocked at the moment. Alright, so I am, again, full on inventory space. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring that stone back out here. And I'm just going to dump it. That's 47. That's not bad. We can definitely use that for other things. Alright, so how much copper do we have? We have 21. Uh, I figure 20 would probably be enough to make a, the amount of arrows that we need. So, I'm going to see if I can't find more tin. And we'll mine that out. We'll try to get 20 out of that. Just trying to find my way around the mines is a little bit uh, confusing. Uh, there's some tin. So that brings us to 23. I think that'll be enough, honestly. At least for now. Um, and then we can carry the rest of the stones back in the basket that I brought. Because I remembered the baskets. <laughs> so I'll put that over here. Normally this would be too heavy.
Alright, so I'm heading out to where that bear was that I remember. It should be... Let's see if I can remember where it is. I think it's right up here. Uh, not too far away from our settlement. We're about maybe halfway between the two. Actually, no, because... No, oh, maybe. Because that's where the cave is there. That's our settlement. And then there's a cave... I think this is where the cave is right here so that one has a bear so it's about halfway I would say between the two but um, some of the caves have bears some of them don't and uh, I got 40 bronze arrows and then we got some stone arrows on us as well uh, the bronze arrows do 45 damage where the stone arrows only do 25 so we should be able to do a quite a bit amount of damage with the recurve bow that we have. And it's just a matter of getting in a position that we can actually attack the bear and stuff. And then once we get that taken care of, we can go ahead and block off the... Uh, or build a fence so that the bear doesn't spawn so we can get more ore easily from this mine. Now, I haven't gone up this way before, like recently so I'm not sure where all the animals and stuff are can't remember but okay um okay, maybe this isn't where the cave is was it here or no 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 it was over here okay um on the other ridge there. Okay, so we'll have to go up a little bit more. Just keep our eye out for bandits. They're pretty common in these parts. So we have a few options. Bear is usually near the cave. So if we go up above the cave, we might be able to snipe them. Oh, boy. And uh, that's two bears. Okay, that was one. There's another bear, though. Um...
guys. So we got uh, a couple things done that I needed to get done for uh, this game. Uh, we killed two bears today. Um, though I'm not sure if I got the meat from the second one. Might have to go back up there and take a look. I might have gotten it. I can't remember. Uh, it might just be laying in the ditch or something somewhere. Ooh, um, my memory's not that good these days. Uh, let's just take a quick look around here, though, at uh, this town. I started building a fence along here. Uh, there's going to be a fence that kind of goes wraps around this way a little bit, and then there's going to be a fence that goes down to about here. Can't put a fence up to this part because there's rocks in the way, so can't build there. But I did build a um, log fence around the perimeter. Um, I figured the natural cave or natural cliff side will be good enough for deterrent for the most part. There will be um, our stables on this side, um, either our donkey stable or our uh, horse stable. I think having it on either side would probably be good, and then that will open up jobs for up here as well. Um, we don't really need too many people. We could probably build another house even right over here, and that would probably fill the quota that we need for this settlement, possibly. And then I built a table and uh, a couple benches for this lady up here that lives because she didn't have anywhere to sit yet. So that's basically what I did. Uh, today we also went mining. We got that cave secured. And um, next episode, if I remember, then we will go up to that cave again and we'll just take a quick look to make sure I uh, got the meat from that bear because I can't remember if I did or not. So um, if not, then we'll go ahead and collect what we need from it but outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out